Do you want to get paid for drinking alcohol? In this video, I'm going to show you how you can. Yo, what is up guys? Tom here, back again with another video, and I'm super excited to share this one with you because I've managed to make more than $4,000 for drinking alcohol. That's right, getting paid to drink alcohol. Sounds crazy, sounds ridiculous, but in this video, I wanna break it down for you, show you how I did it so that you guys can go out and do the same. So essentially what I wanna do is first open up the app and walk you through how everything works so you can get an understanding of how you can do it yourself. And then I wanna go around uh, for a whole day and do all of these what's called missions and see how much money I can make uh, in one night from drinking alcohol at all these different bars. And you guys can come along for the journey with me. So let's, without further ado, jump into the app and I'll show you how everything works so that you can go out and do it yourself. And then, like I said, after that, uh, I'll do a quick montage or compilation of me going around to all these different bars, doing all the missions and seeing how much I can make in one night from drinking alcohol. So without further ado, like I said, let's jump into the app and I'll show you how it works. All right, as you can see, this is the app. It is called Snooper. Uh, and when you open it up, you're going to see a little map pop up with all these little icons of money. Uh, and so these are basically what they call missions. And so these are the things that you do to get paid. Uh, and so there's not just the drinking ones, but there is also um, other ones like this one, for example, uh, where you just take a, a couple pictures around an IGA store of a certain brand and you get paid $6, right? Uh, and so that one, you don't have to buy any products for. You just go and take a couple photos and you're done. And so if you click on the overview, it's going to give you an overview of what needs to be done. And then the checkpoints is going to give you the step-by-step -step things you need to do. So you can see, just take about three or four photos uh, and you're done, right? So very, very easy, very simple to do that. And that's $6. So um, you'll find these like everywhere. You can see they're all scattered everywhere. Uh, let's go into Sydney actually. Uh, and find the drinking ones because I want to focus on just the drinking ones for this video But you can go ahead and do any of the missions that are on there um, Because there's tons of different things you can do and lots of different ways to make money here So the drinking ones you can see this one is an Asahi one um, Which is a very easy mission to do. Let's actually filter by um, Just the drinking mission so we can look at just those So Somersby as well Cool. So now you can see just the drinking missions. You can see we've got a couple here. Uh, and so if we open up one, this is a Summersby one. So you can basically go in to the checkpoints and it'll show you everything you need to do. So photos of the venue, photos of the main bar area, photos of the other bar areas, photos of your drink and the receipt, and then photo of all the promo materials. So very simple, very straightforward to do, pretty easy to get done. Uh, and then once you do that, you submit the mission. It'll go into review. Once they review it, uh, you get paid, right? The Asahi ones, the Peroni ones, the Heineken ones, those are all the easiest ones. So you can see it's literally just photos of the venue, photos of the taps, and then photo of your beer. So very, very simple to do uh, for the beer missions. Uh, and sometimes they have all different ones, right? They'll have gin and tonic, and one time they had Pim's jugs, and I freaking love Pim's, so those were awesome. Um, but that's essentially how it works, right? So you go in, uh, you order the beer, take the photos they need, submit the mission, that's it, done, right? So very, very simple. All right, so that's basically how all the missions work. Very simple, very straightforward. Now, before we go into the bars and I show you how much I can make in one night doing this, I first want to walk you through a couple key things that are going to help you to do these missions a lot easier. All right, so the first thing that can really help you is actually renting out uh, rental bikes like these ones, for example. This is a line bike. Uh, and so in, in Melbourne, I believe you can get it for $16 for the whole day. So that gives you 24 hours of like, unlimited rides to go around the whole city. And um, basically, you can use that to get around from pub to pub to pub, especially if they're all spread out, right? It really helps to have that mode of transport to get around to all the pubs really quickly uh, and do more missions in the time that you have available. And because you'll be using your phone so much and taking a lot of photos and if you're doing a lot of bar missions in one night, power bank, the absolute play. You've got to have one if you're going to do a ton of missions in one night um, because your phone dies real quick if you're taking a lot of photos and on Snooper a lot of the time. So as long as you have one of these, you should be good to go for the night. And last tip really quickly is obviously you're buying the beer. And so if you can get in happy hour times and get the beer for cheaper, you're obviously going to make more profit. Or a ninja hack is go with a friend or two and have them buy the beer and then you just use their beer for the mission, right? And you don't have to buy anything. Um, so there's different options you can do to get around that, like buying the beer thing. All right, we got our 
on bikes, so this is gonna be the best way to get around from bar to bar. So it's time for some snooper missions, boy, let's go. All right, first mission done. So that one cost $10. And it was an $18 mission, so $8 profit on this bad boy right here. Alright, so I obviously got pretty drunk pretty quick, because like drinking all this alcohol, obviously get drunk. So uh, I didn't take videos at every single bar, but what I did do is I took a photo of every beer that I had, and I wrote down how much I paid for the beer, how much was the mission, and how much profit did I make uh, in total from that beer alone. And so basically I'm going to just whack those screenshots up here, on the side here, as you can see. And then um, we'll go through these together. So you can see beer number one, we made $8 profit. Good start, really good start. Beer two, $5.50. Uh, beer three, we made $5.82. Uh, beer four, we made $7.35. And you can see that the total profit for the day as well on the bottom there, slowly creeping up. Beer six, $6. Uh, beer seven. Beer eight, we made the most amount of profit. We made $12 profit on one beer, which is pretty crazy. Uh, so you can see we've just passed $50 in profit for the day, $73. Uh, you can see most of these are Asahi and Peroni missions. So the beer missions, uh, which are the $18 missions. So I didn't do any of the Summersby ones uh, because there wasn't any around the area I was at. You can see we just passed $100 with beer 15, beer 16, uh, beer 17, beer 18, $6.30 profit. Beer 19, and you can see all the different pubs and bars we're going to. You get to like go around to all these different places. Uh, beer 21, and then beer 22 is where I ended it, which means that we spent a total of $250.49 on beers. Uh, the total mission payout was $396, and the total profit overall was $145.51. And I spent a total of 6.5 hours out going around the city on my line bike, traveling around to bar to bar. Uh, and yeah, we did 22 missions in total. So we went to 22 bars in total. Uh, actually, no, that's not true because some of the bars had multiple missions in the one place. Um, but yeah, overall, pretty good, pretty good time. You know, I had fun, was out for 6.5 hours, just drinking, having fun. Uh, I wouldn't say I was rushing around too much, so that was kind of like, you know, chilling out at each bar and just relaxing a bit, uh, and I managed to hit 22 of them and make $145 in profit, so that's pretty much how it works, uh, and then what I'll do is now I'll jump into the Snooper app and show you uh, how the cash out thing works, um, and that's pretty much that. All right, as you can see, we are now in the Snooper app, and uh, this is basically what it should look like once you submit all your missions. You'll see some are in review, some get approved, and once they get approved, they go, uh, has a little green successful bar. Um, and then if you click on your bank, this is where it's gonna show you how much is in waiting for validation, which means it's in review, and how much is actually in your account balance, which means you can actually cash that out. And so all you have to do is put your payment details, so your bank details, um, your account number and your BSB in the account details section. And then when you click cash out, it'll basically cash out whatever money you have in the balance straight to that those account details, right? And it can take a day or two to transfer, so um, it can take some time there, but that is pretty much how it works. So I hope you found this video useful and I hope you make some money going out drinking. I'm going to continue doing this uh, if I'm ever in Australia. It's an Australian app, so there's probably apps that do the same same or similar stuff overseas if you are overseas. Uh, but if you're in Australia, this is a great way to make some money uh, for your nights out drinking, you know? So great way to do it. Even if you just have one or two beers, you still make some, you know, some profit and, um, yeah, that's pretty much that. So if you guys found this video useful and you want me to do more videos like this, uh, please leave a comment below. I'm, I love topics like this and just weird things where you make money in weird ways. So if you want to hear more awesome stories of things that I've found, uh, drop some comments below and I'll share some awesome things with you. But that is pretty much all from me today, guys. I hope you have a wonderful time drinking, getting drunk, and getting paid for it. That's all from me, guys. Here's to freedom.